You might have noticed some slowdowns or performance problems when you save or submit forms in Redmine. These can be any number of things, but let me share one possibility with you that might actually save you a bunch of time. Many of the actions in Redmine cause a notification email to be sent. Normally these are fast and not really noticeable, but under some circumstances they can slow everything down. A common failure is actually caused by a bad or misconfigured DNS server. What happens is Redmine needs to connect to the mail server to send the email. But if the mail server is configured to use a domain name, the Redmine has to look up that domain name before it knows where the mail server is. I've personally seen this become a problem when the DNS server isn't responding or when it's too slow to respond. Either of these cases can cause Redmine to wait, sometimes up to 30 seconds or more for a timeout. So first thing to do is to check your DNS servers from your Redmine server and make sure Redmine can actually look up the mail server IP address. One way you can work around this is by hard coding the mail server's IP address in Redmine itself, which would actually bypass DNS. Another source of problems is with the mail server itself. Even if the server responds, it might respond slowly or maybe it might error out one time or another time. Once again, this can cause Redmine to wait, which would end up making the browser wait too. If you control the mail server, you might be able to find and fix the problem there. I mean, maybe the mail server is having DNS problems too. If not, there is a way to work around it. In your email configuration for Redmine, there is an option to send mail asynchronously. This means that Redmine will send the email in the background while it processes your request. The nice thing about this is that you can keep working in your browser even while it's sending the email, and email delays won't actually slow you down. To enable this, change the delivery method to be prefixed by an async, and restart your Redmine server. You might want to do an update in a form to kind of make sure the email is actually getting sent. If not, you'll see right away and you can switch it back. Hopefully this gives you a few places to look if you start to see some performance problems with Redmine when you're submitting forms. That wraps up this screencast. This video is just one video in my Redmine series. If you go to theadmin.org forward slash videos, then I'll send you the entire series for free. Thanks again for watching.